Hey guys, it's Victoria. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be using the Morphe 35V palette. This is the Stunning Vibes palette, and it is exclusively sold at Ulta. These are, this is what it looks like. So there's a bunch of different shades in here. I feel like I could create a million looks with this palette. But yeah, the shades in here are super pretty, and I cannot wait to try out another Morphe product. So let's get started. Once again, this is the whole palette. There's burgundy, neutrals, and blues, and purple, and green, every color you can imagine, for the most part. Um, but there's a bunch of shades in this palette, and I feel like I could do so many things with this, so I'm super excited to try this palette out, and Morphe is always super affordable, and their products are usually really great quality, so I'm super excited for this one. So I already applied some primer to my lids. I'm just going to start out with this light neutral shade, as I always do, just to have a nice base for all of our other eyeshadow. Now I'm going to go into this shade right here and apply that into my crease. I'm going into the shade Devoted, which is this green shade on the end here, and I'm just adding that into my crease. But now I'm going to go into this shade right here in the middle and apply this to my lids. Now I'm going into this blue shade right here and I'm just adding this into my crease. I'm going to go into the shade Heat, which is this orange shade down here at the bottom, and I'm just going to pack that onto my lids. And then I'm going to go back into that green and reapply that. I'm reapplying that same blue shade. Now I'm using a blending brush and blending this out. Now I'm just going to reapply that orange and then I'm going to add a little bit of this shade right here in the shade Spice and the shade in the zone and I'm just going to add this towards my outer corners and blend that up. And then I'm going back in and mixing the blue and the green and reapplying that. Now I'm going to do a cut crease. So I'm going to take some concealer on an angled brush and I'm just going to, I'm going to just go into this shade at the end here, this green shade, and sort of add that. Adding this bronzy shade, you see in our corner. And then I'm going to add this blue shade. I'm going back in and mixing these two shades and just lining. Pretty much the very edge. I'm going to use my NYX Matte Black Liquid Liner and just create my wings. Well, I also added a little bit of that liquid liner just right on the inner quarter part. It's from like about here to here. I just lined with some black liquid liner. Now I'm going back into these bronzy shades and I'm going to just redefine the gold shade going across. And I'm also going to bring it a little bit down onto the top of my wing. Now I'm just going to do my face makeup and then I'll be right back. Highlighter, I'm using these two shades from the Smashbox Blaze collection. And now I'm going to go back into the eyeshadow palette and just apply this shimmery shade of that to my inner corners. And also to my brow bone, I'm going to mix this shade and the white shade. And for lashes, I'm applying these Ardell lashes that look the lashes I'm using today look like this, and I'm just going to apply them. Now I'm using this blue 
NYX Eye Pencil in the shade Deep Blue. And I'm just adding this to my waterline. I'm going to go into the blue and the green shade and put that on the outer quarter of my waterline. Then I'm adding those bronzy shades to the inner half. For lips, I'm using this NYX uh, Matte Pencil in the shade Lavender and Lace. And I'm just going to line my lips. I'm using the Kylie Cosmetics Lipstick in the shade Creme Brulee. And I'm just going to apply it. It's a nice nude shade, which is perfect with, the, with this eye look. And I also forgot to mention I added some mascara, but this is the finished look. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell button when you subscribe. It's right next to it to turn on my post notifications so you're notified when I upload every single new video. And be sure to go check out last week's video if you haven't already. And you guys can also find me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, which will all be linked down below in the description, along with all the products that I used in today's video. And I loved this palette. Um, again, it's only sold at Ulta, and if there's not one by you, then you can go to Ulta.com. I will link it down below for you guys. Um, and this palette is definitely worth the money. Um, I love this palette. I cannot wait to try out more looks with it. Um, Morphe's products are always really great quality, so I was not expecting anything less from them. I've never done bluish and bronzy, orangey colors together before, and so it's always fun to try out different shades and see how it turns out. So let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!